Ipex Wicked Kitchen, my low carb, healthy eating friends and families. I'm going to show you how to make some Asian stir fried vegetables with the shrimp. Very easy, simple. When you get home in 10 minutes, you'll have a great restaurant meal. We're gonna start with the baby bok choy. Then we have broccoli chopped, washed, clean. Then I have, uh, I guess this is the Asian uh, eggplant because they are long, not the round ones. They're nice and skinny. Then we have some scallions chopped up. Our uh, sliced mushrooms. Red hot peppers, jalapeno peppers, sliced carrots. I have some ginger sliced, it smells yummy. I have some uh, shallot and chopped, smashed uh, garlic, white onions, and then we got some bean sprouts. Then I'm gonna mix them up. I also have some tiger shrimp, which will add to uh, in our vegetables and it's gonna taste yum yum let's get to it guys all right uh, first make sure you have a real hot pan like non-stick pan you can have a wok which i have uh, i love enjoy um pour some um avocado oil because there is no smoke point and then here a little bit because i'm gonna do two different things same time we can cook and dance same time, guys. I'm doing my um, shrimp first. You have to hear the chisel. When it's not chiseling, then it's not hard enough. And never put anything in your pan if it's cold. Okay, we have about a pound of tiger shrimp clean, divine. Okay. Now we're gonna, uh, Meanwhile, I'm going to put my vegetables. We're going to start with our onion, okay? Okay. And next one, we're going to put some garlic. Eggplant. Now we can turn off the shrimp because we're gonna add it all, so they're gonna cook again. So you just want them get some brown color, red color. Look how nice, yummy, yummy. Okay, that's all they need. And you want them nice and fluffy. Shrimp never needs to be overcooked. Two minutes. That's it. Now we're gonna focus on our uh, stir fried vegetables. So make sure your uh, wok is real hot. And then we start with the, our firmest vegetables, the ones they uh, cook longer, which is in this case eggplant. Then we got some carrots. Okay, and I'm gonna this time add some sesame oil, but you have to have that. You want some yummy Asian food, okay? Sprinkle some chili peppers, unless you don't like hot meal, then you can move this. And now we're gonna add some ginger, our ginger. That's definitely gonna give some savory, sour, Asian. Now we're gonna add our peppers. Again, more spicy vegetables. Put them with your discretion if you don't like how spicy the meal. And I'm gonna add some mushrooms. Because they uh, release some liquid. I wanna cook them earlier. Now I'm gonna add some Broccoli. Broccoli. Again, these vegetables only need to be five minutes. You don't need to 
kill them, you want to really eat them fried, not cooked. What kind of saute? Hot. Okay, these bok choy are going to shrink, so don't worry. They're gonna be like spinach. They become very small when they shrink. So I'm gonna put all my vegetables on top and maybe more, more sesame oil because we added more vegetables. And don't worry about sesame oil is good for you. No carb. It's just very uh, wholesome uh, oil. I'm going to add some more Asian uh, chili sauce with the garlic. Look guys, look how nice it is. I mean, I wasn't born in Japan, but I sure can taste and flavor and I know what goes with what. And I study a lot, I read, I watch. And so you can uh, have a yummy, yummy, yummy food. I'm too lazy to go out and order food. And not to mention, I don't trust other people's cooking. All right, so now I have uh, liquid amino, which will replace our soy sauce because we don't want to have any carbs, any sugar in our diet, right? So I'm just going to like... Maybe a couple tablespoons. You can just measure. I never use measure uh, cup. I just sprinkle. It's good. Good stuff. Liquid amino. And then I'm going to add some mirin. Uh, like a Japanese white wine. Just a little bit for the flavor. And I think I need to sprinkle some salt because you really don't use a lot of uh, soy sauce. I got a pink, pink salt. You don't use table salt, no quality. This is a good stuff like sea salt, better than. Has a potassium, magnesium, and all the minerals in there. I'm gonna about to turn it off and Add my shrimp. Watch what happens. Now you triple the meal. Now you can have whole week long. You can freeze it, you can reheat it. And then I'm gonna add some, I have some beef broth I made earlier. I will give some beef flavor with the shrimp. Now, if you're a vegetarian, just don't add the shrimp, don't add the beef uh, broth. Just use a uh, vegetarian veggie broth. Same thing. And the last, I'm going to add my bean sprouts and your green onions, scallions. Here's the stir-fried Asian style shrimp with Asian vegetables. Enjoy it within less than 10 minutes without leaving your house. We'll see you next time in the next video.